when Barack Obama, the last year of his term, he commuted the sentences of thousands of Americans of every color. That's not prison reform. You know why? Because there's nothing systemically being done to change the way people are charged, tried, sentenced, and treated in prison and released. Right, yeah. When Donald Trump was towards the end of his year, he commuted a lot of sentences, including Little Wayne. He and threw his case out. Yep. We go to Detroit with our brother, who was the former mayor, Kwame Kilpatrick. He released him out of prison, right? Mm -hmm. But that's tokenism. You know why? Because I chose you. I'm not doing nothing about what your people are going through. Okay. I'm just going to single out Kwame Kilpatrick. I chose you. I'm not doing nothing about your people, but I'm going to single out Little Wayne. We have yeah. to be careful to not allow tokenism to substitute for systemic measurable change. I give you another one. They'll talk about the economy and they'll say, well, we got a thousand more black millionaires in America than we had 20 years ago. That's tokenism. There's 50 million American Africans. Don't you dare try to distract from the poverty, the underachievement, the homelessness, that the millions suffer from and try to distract me by saying there's a thousand more black millionaires. Progress is in the group, not in the token. Don't single me out and say, well, you got six degrees. You never been to jail. You're a doctor. You come from the ghetto of North Philly. Why can't every black man do it? Because every black man isn't given the opportunity that I was given. See, we have to make sure we don't buy into this narrative of the power structure that wants to take individuals' examples of success and use that to chastise all the failures so we can blame our people yeah. for where they are.